Hello friends, greetings from Iceland. Finally we have an interview with uh, Professor Thorvaldur Thordrason, leading Icelandic volcanologist, expert on volcanic eruptions. In Iceland, in my opinion, is the best and the one we should really listen to. And he tells that this eruption can go for quite a while, unlike the December eruption which lasted only for two and a half days. This eruption might last for uh, some weeks. And why? He explains here in the article. He, say, he tells that the data seems to indicate that the additional flow is coming in from the magma chamber that is larger and at a greater depth than a small magma chamber that is 5-10 kilometers deep and contains a relatively small amount of magma. It is bad news from Grindavik because it could mean that the current eruption will last much longer than the previous eruption. It is similar sequence of events that took place in the eruption in Gelengadalur Valley back in 2021, which lasted for six months, as you know. Back in 2021, then we had another eruption in 22, which lasted two weeks, and then again we had eruption in the same area in 23 in July, which lasted for three weeks. We could see a similar pattern here. Unfortunately, this could be quite a stretch of time, says Thorvaldur. Uh, then he says, uh, when asked if there is a possibility that another crack will form inside the town, he tells this could go for quite a while. And they say also that the lava walls, lava berms, did their job to prevent most of the lava um, flowing into the town, turning away the lava. And there was a hope that it would be short and weak eruption. However, um, the news about the new fissure, which formed up close to the city, uh, was bad. And it seems that it was an addition. <clears throat> it is some additional magma that comes in from a greater depth uh, that opened this new crack. That is his opinion. Uh, now we will take a look at the pictures uh, of uh, the volcanic eruption in Green Day, how lava is moving inside the town. <clears throat> 